Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I had a fun day with one of my friends and we went out and went shopping, went to Dollar Tree and Walmart, and I got a bunch of great stuff. So what better way to end a shopping trip than to come home and film a haul, right? Because I know that I'm nosy and I love to see what other people get at the Dollar Tree and I like to see if there's things that they get that my Dollar Tree might have and I figured that I would film what I got so that you guys could see what we have at ours and maybe give you guys a little bit of inspiration. So I have, um, it's kind of two hauls put into one. I have a Walmart haul and then I also have a Dollar Tree haul, but I think I'm gonna do the Dollar Tree haul first because I know that's what a lot of people like. So I got a lot of great things at the Dollar Tree today. I spent, I think like $23, so I got 23 items. Um, and I got things for home and car and some things for my kids. So let's get into it. So the first couple of things that I got are for my home and I got this and these are just little um, canisters that I got for Mason. I figured that I could put things in here for his lunch and just throw it in his lunch bag and I just thought they were really cute. I love the color. So I got those and sticking in that same color line I got these. These are just a four pack of cups and we actually love these cups um, to bring up in our room at nighttime. We fill it up with ice water or whatever and bring it up so that we can have um, water on the bedside table and the kids do as well. So I figured I'd get these because they're not gonna break because we have a serious issue with breaking glasses or cups or anything else. So that's why I got these and like I said, I do love this color. The next thing that I got for my home is this yard yard yardly oatmeal and almond um, dry skin soap or moisturizing bath bar and it smells really good and I really love oatmeal scented soaps so it looks like this and it has gentle exfoliants to relieve dry skin so can't wait to try this and then I also got this. And this is called Aero Foam Juicy Grapefruit Foaming Hand Wash. And one of my friends actually um, recommended this to me. She said it smells really good, which it does. And she said that it reminds her of Bath and Body Works soap. So for a dollar, I figured I'd try it. I love grapefruit scents. And then I got this, which is just Sesame Street Baby Wash. Um, I figured I would just grab this for me since it smells really good. It smells like a baby. Wow, my face is super red. Don't mind that. I just got done blow drying my hair, so my face is really red. But yeah, this smells like a baby, so I figured I'd get this and I'd use it because he is a freak about getting um, shampoo in his eyes. So I figured I would get some um, tear-free baby wash. And the next thing that I got for Mason is this. And this is the Angel of Mine Baby Rum Air Freshener. And it seriously smells like baby powder. So I can't wait to try this in his room. Okay, and then the next four things that I got kind of go, all go together. So the first thing that I got was this. And this is the Benzac Acne Solutions Skin Balancing Foaming Cleanser with Calming and Soothing East Indian Sandalwood Oil. And this is step one, this is a cleanse. Um, there is three steps to this particular um, face wash. So this is the first step. Um, and I saw this and I was like, hmm, maybe we should try it because I, I've been getting breakouts, Jordan's been getting breakouts. So I figured we would get this and try it and see how it works. And then step two. Step two is the intensive spot treatment. And it also has the calming East Indian sandalwood oil. And this has salicylic acid in it. And that's really good for clearing breakups. Breakups. It's really good for clearing breakouts. God, I can't talk. So, let's see. 
This says, for the treatment of acne, penetrates pores to eliminate most acne blemishes and help prevent new ones from forming. Directions, clean the skin, cover the affected area. So this is like if you get a breakout, you just put it, you know, on your, on your acne bumps and it's supposed to help get rid of them. And then step three. Step three is the blemish clearing hydrator. And it also has the same thing, the Indian sandalwood oil. It also has salicylic acid, but not as much. And um, this you put all over your face after you, after you cleanse and after you use the spot treatment, you put this all over your face to hydrate. And then to go along with that, I got this. And this is a facial brush and it gently exfoliates, massages, and cleans your skin. So we actually were talking about getting like a clear sonic or something because we need something that's going to exfoliate as well as, you know, get deep into our pores. Um, but I saw this for a dollar and I was like, well, might as well try this before we invest into something more to see how we like it. So I did get this to use with the um, cleanser. And then to go along with that, I also got this. And this is the Dermacil Oil-Free Night Moisturizer Facial Cream with vitamin A and E. And this you put on at night, and Jordan has been getting really, really bad dry skin, like right around his nose and up on his forehead, and he's always telling me that he really needs a moisturizer that's going to work good, and he doesn't want it to be greasy or look oily, so I figured I would get this one so he could put it on after we get out of the shower at night, and he could leave it on throughout the night, and then, you know, hopefully it will clear up his dry skin around his face, because main winters are brutal, and that's what happens when you live in a cold area. And then I also got these. And these are in the orange color. I I was looking for the ones in the teal to kind of match the other items that I got, but they didn't have them. So these are just little water bottles. I figured that I could put um, water in there for Mason to put in his backpack or juice or whatever. We usually drink Crystal Light, so I could probably put that in here as well. And it's got the snap closure, so I wouldn't have to worry about it spilling throughout his lunch bag. And then I just got some Q-tips because we're running low. So for Mason's lunches, I got these. The um, breadsticks with the cheese dip and they come five in a pack for a dollar. So I thought that was a good deal. And I've gotten these before. Mason really likes them. So I figured I would grab them at the dollar store instead of paying three dollars at the at the grocery store. And then this is what I got for my car, which I was super excited about. I got this. And it has an open, an open thing. And I also got these, which these are the small scented garbage bags. And I'm going to put a little garbage bag in this and then just keep this in the side of my car just so that I can put like receipts or straw wrappers or any loose um, trash that I come in contact with because we just bought a brand new car and I really want to try to keep it clean. So I figured that I would get this um, to see if I could minimize my trash in my car. So I'm hoping that this works. Plus, these smell pretty good. They smell like fresh rose. And you get 50 in a pack for a dollar. For me, I got these. And these are the Sassy and Chic Nail Stickers. Now, I have not tried these yet, but I see them every single time I go to the Dollar Tree. So, Ashley picked up a pack and I picked up a pack and we figured that we would use them and do a review. Um, just to see if they work as well as you know other ones like they have some at they I believe they have an SE brand and they have a couple other brands at Walmart plus they have obviously Jamberry um, which do work really well so I'm excited to see if these work and I will film a tutorial and also a review on these in the future so keep your eye out for that and then I got Michaela some hair tie because I made her a little pouch with um, a hairbrush and other things for her hair so that she could keep everything together and not have to run around the house every morning looking for her hairbrush and I figured I would put some hair ties in there for her as well so that she wouldn't always be searching for hair ties. Last but not least I picked up this journal 
and the inside's really cute. And I also picked up this package of pens. And these are ballpoint pens. They're just in different colors. They had another one with like four colors and then we found these which have six colors. And I think most of you guys know that I am an Erin Condren junkie. So I love to pick up new pens to see how they work in my planner. But I also figured that I'd keep one with this journal and keep it either in my purse or in my car so that when I need to write down something, I'm not constantly searching for a pen and paper. And I really think this journal is cute, by the way. So that was it for everything that I bought at the Dollar Tree. Next, we're gonna go into the things that I got at Walmart, which most of it is for a baby shower for one of my friends who does not have YouTube, so I don't think she'll be seeing this, but we have a baby shower to go to tomorrow, and she is uh, one of my friends that I grew up with and haven't seen her. We haven't been in contact for a while. Uh, and one of our mutual friends invited me to her baby shower. So I'm really excited that I got invited. And I went to Walmart and grabbed a couple things for her baby shower. So I'll show you what I end up getting her. So first thing that I got is this. And it says baby boys rock. And it's a huge bag. And I thought that was really cute with the glitter. So that's what I'm gonna package everything up in. And then to go along with that, I just got white tissue paper because I love putting tissue paper in my gifts. <clears throat> and then I got this for me. And this is the clean, the clutch and clean. And it is, it has a zipper, not a zipper, but a clasp closure and then it's got baby wipes in it and I figured that I could keep this in my car just for um, the kids to wipe off or pretty much for anything spills or whatever I do have armor all cleaning wipes that I also keep in there but I figured I could keep these in there for little sticky hands and plus the patterns really cute and it's got this so I figured I could um, snap it around my headrest on my front seat and next thing that I got for me is this And it looks like that came with a charging USB thing. And this is the magnetic mount phone holder. I don't know how this is gonna work. It was on clearance for $2.50. And I've been wanting to find something that I can stick my phone onto or stick my camera onto. So when I'm driving, I can have it up there because we use my phone to play music. So I figured that if I had it right there, I wouldn't be constantly having it in my hands and trying to drive because that just really freaks me out. Plus I have the 6S Plus and it is huge. It's like this big. So I have to use it with two hands. And so I figured if I had something to hold it like this that it would make it less of a job for me to switch the music or answer the phone or whatever while I'm driving. Um, I don't know if it's gonna work. We'll see. I'll let you guys know. I could do a review on this as well. Um, but it, like I said, it was $2.50 and I was like, I need one. So I grabbed it and I'm excited to see if it actually is going to work or not. Now back to the baby shower item. So the first thing that I got for the baby shower is this. These are the Pampers Swaddlers in the size one. And I loved these diapers when my kids were little. I think they smell so good and they're really soft. So I figured she would like these. And the next thing I got were these little washcloths. And they're super cute. They have whales on them. And her theme for her baby's nursery is whales. So I tried to stay along the whales theme. To go along with the diapers, I got this. These are the Pampers wipes and they have the whale on them. And it, the whale's actually a unicorn, which I thought was kind of cute. And then it has jellyfish. So I thought these are really cute. They would go along with the theme. And I figured she would like them. And then I got this little child of mine, um, little monkey, and it has a teething ring on it. Super cute. And I got these receiving blankets, which they have the whales and then triangles and just nautical colors, so I figured that she would really like these to match her theme. I personally love them. If I ever have a baby, all my friends, I want these. 
can never have too many receiving blankets either. And then last but not least, I got her this NECA bottle and it has owl and a fox and a hedgehog. And I thought it was super cute and my kids loved nut puppies and I'm not sure if she's trying to breastfeed or if she's going to bottle feed but I figured usually people who breastfeed they pump so you can always have bottles right plus it's super cute so yeah that was pretty much everything that I got on this haul like I said I had a lot of fun I saved a bunch of money and I hope that you guys got some inspiration of what is at the Dollar Tree in case you guys are interested in getting anything for your home or your car or anything else so I always love going to the Dollar Tree and I'm so happy that they actually put one in my town because the closest Dollar Tree to us is over an hour away but they just put one in our town so I'm super excited about that so yeah I hope you guys enjoyed this video and if you did please give me a thumbs up and leave a comment down below let me know if there if you got any inspiration from this video um, if you're planning on going to a Dollar Tree anytime soon and what your favorite product is and also if you haven't already please subscribe to my channel I'm gonna try to be doing more videos throughout the week um, but you can always guarantee that I'm going to have at least one to two videos a week. Alright guys, have a good day. Bye.